The following information in this video comes largely from an article written by Joe Kovacs of WorldNet Daily. The article is entitled, Hawaii Elections Clerk, Obama Was Not Born Here. It was written June the 10th, 2010. Could this information be the smoking gun to Obama's eligibility issue? A college instructor, it seems, who worked as a senior elections clerk for the city and county of Honolulu in 2008, apparently is making the stunning claim that Barack Obama was absolutely and definitely not born in Hawaii as the White House has maintained all along. And he is also claiming that a long-form hospital-generated birth certificate for Obama does not even exist in the Aloha State. Tim Adams, a former senior elections clerk for Honolulu, now teaches English at Western Kentucky University. Adams claims that he's been telling other people about this information for a long time, but that now he's finally free to talk about it since he no longer has any confidentiality restrictions from his former employer, the Honolulu government. He says that people started paying attention just this week after he was briefly interviewed by James Edwards, host of a weekly radio show on WLRM Radio in Memphis, Tennessee. Tim Adams says, there is no birth certificate. It's like an open secret, he says. There just isn't one. Everyone in the government in Hawaii knows it. Adams goes on to say, I manage the absentee ballot office. It was my job to verify the voters' identity. Adams says that during the 2008 campaign, when the issue of Obama's constitutional eligibility first arose, that the elections office was inundated with requests to verify the birthplace of Obama. Adams says, I had direct access to the Social Security database, the National Crime Computer, state driver's license information, international passport information, basically just about anything you can imagine to get someone's identity. He said, I could look up what bank your home mortgage was in. I was informed by my boss that we did not have a birth record for Obama. At that same time, there were conflicting reports that Obama had been born at one of these two hospitals in Honolulu. So, Adam says his office checked with both facilities. They told us, Adam said, we do not have a birth certificate for Obama. They told my supervisor, either by phone or by email, neither one has a document that a doctor signed off on saying they were present at Obama's birth. To date, no Hawaiian hospital has provided documented confirmation that Obama was born at its facility. Neither has any governmental agency of the state of Hawaii or any other state in the United States. Also to date, the following records are sealed with the full knowledge of Obama after he has reportedly spent well over one million dollars to ensure their sealing. These are the records that Obama has sealed. To date, neither Obama nor any of his supporters have proven his birthplace nor his constitutional eligibility to serve as President of the United States as a natural-born citizen.